Greetings, everybody, and welcome back to The Long Dark. I'm L2, and uh, this is uh, our endeavor to go through the Sandbox Alpha 302, version 302. Uh, we will continue on with our Stalker try, which is the hardest mode. Uh, this is try 12. We are currently 8 days and 51 minutes uh, in. Our avatar is in good shape. We are down at the camp office. We have uh, killed a couple of wolves now and uh, and uh, fully dressed them and got all the meat hide and guts and we've uh, cooked that up and we should be waking up now after a good night's sleep and there we are let's see how we're doing here a bit on the thirsty side but we'll drink some water we're down to about uh, what is it uh, let's see once we're done gulping that down we're bound to, down to two tenths of a gallon um, so it looks like food wise we're looking good so why don't we go ahead and go downstairs, we'll crank up a fire, cook up a little more water for us to take out on our daily yearning. As you can see here, we have two wolf hides. We've got four guts and various stages of drying and curing. Uh, we'll go ahead and pick a piece of wood up here or two. Uh, see how our wood here is doing. Oh, good, a cured sapling. We'll take that. We'll just skip ahead a little bit here. We've uh, taken care of our pack, gotten some extra water, and now we're ready to head on outside anyway um, what we want to do at this point is let's go outside you'll see that we've got a warmth bonus right now so that's that helps us let's see what the weather's like outside and as I always do we will step outside check the weather oh look at that that's a deer oh. we're going to crouch And we missed it. No use wasting any more shots. I don't think we hit it in the least. Why am I doing that? <laughs> uh, let's go see if we hit it. There'll be blood on the ground if we did. But I don't think we hit it at all, guys. I think we just scared him away. Yep. Oh, well. Well, that was stupid. Let's reload. Oh, we have no more bullets to reload. All right, well, let's unequip the gun so we're not wasting any more bullets. What do you say? Well, that's disappointing. Well, we have eight shots left. But, uh... <laughs> all I had intended to do was to step outside and check the weather. Um, uh, looks like it's pretty good. Um... <laughs> So you see, that's when you do something without uh, uh, versus planning something. Uh, so we just wasted two shots uh, on on something we really didn't need to. So I'm gonna step back inside, recreate our save point. There we go. Um, let's see here. Fuel wise, we're down to 24.36. How much was left in that that silly can? 79. Um, yeah, let's give it a minute and we'll eat the last of that and then we'll move on with life um, dang I really feel embarrassed that we wasted that uh, uh, wasted those uh, bullets now we've been down to the left um, that's down if you remember correct uh, remember correctly that was down towards the tunnel collapse we've been down there um, and also we've uh, been out to the lake and we've been around that area uh, I don't remember if we've been to the train cars or not let's see I think uh, we can check our our uh, book here have we been remember we were marching over there earlier and we saw some train cars but I don't know that we've been uh, by those or not it looks like not so yeah so it looks like we're good to go here so I think exploration wise we might head down that way just to see what we can see um, now that deer ran right over this way yeah I'm I'm sure that we didn't kill it um, but just just for the sake of making sure I wonder if we should just wander along here and, and look hopefully we don't run into a wolf 
because uh, I don't want to waste any more bullets on wolves at the moment because what we need are deer and the reason we need deer is we have no shoes uh, you know although those look like shoe prints <laughs> we have no shoes we wore through our shoes so what we need is we need three cured deer hides and then you know those four guts that we had back there at the house well those two things combined we can actually make some new boots some deer deer hide boots um, which we sincerely need so but what we'll do for the moment is we'll head down there those are the train cars we saw the other day you see them harder to see today because it's cloudy or foggy but my concern is is that there's probably some wolves that way uh, and if so, the question comes down, do we use the gun or do we use the knife? You know, do we just let it attack and then we kill it and yada yada, you know what I mean? But uh, I guess it depends on how many we see. We're in really good shape. we got lots of food. we got lots of drink on board. In fact, we're going to eat the last of this can of uh, get rid of it. There we go. Drink some more water. Our weight will be down probably to nearly uh, 60 pounds. Look at that. Nearly. We're at si just below 61 pounds. And what I want to do is, if possible... Oh, we got some circling, um, circling crows. That means there's dead bodies. Now, there is a wolf right there. So here's the question. Do we attack the wolf with the gun, or do we attack the wolf with the knife? Um... Oh, there's two wolves. Okay. Well, that's a whole different ball of wax, isn't it? That is an entirely different thing. Let's see. Well, if nothing else, that might have run the wolves off. But unfortunately, it's another wasted shell. So I don't think we hit it. We did, there'd be some blood right here. And I don't see any blood, do you? Nope. So, let's do this. Let's cover what we've got here for the moment. Looks like, oh look, we can get inside this train car. Well, that's a little better. Would rather not have to waste the ammo, but that's definitely better. There's the other one. Looks like he's just running, though. He's not wounded, is he? Let's see. Any blood? Nope, no blood. I'm just hesitant to start trying to take this one apart. There's a chance we're going to get rushed on by another one. Oh, look at that. That's a deer. All right, first things first. The box. Be more ammo. That'll come in handy. Be some boots. Peroxide. That's it, huh? All right. Not so much concerned about the meat because it's only 3.3 pounds. Hour and 25 minutes with the hatchet, 50 minutes with the knife. Listen for the wolf growling. Okay. I see. 20 minutes with the knife, 10 minutes with the hatchet. We'll get the meat because that's deer meat is actually higher protein or higher calorie count than um, the wolf meat. All right, there he is. Wow. Wish I'd quit doing that. 
Oh, there's the other wolf right there. Holy cow. Wow. Okay. Why am I keep doing that? <laughs> uh, all right. Um, let's. That's three wolves, guys. That's that's three wolves. Um. All right. Let's. Uh, how much time of daylight we got? Six hours. Okay. Um. Use the knife. That's eight pounds there. Okay. That's, how long is that going to take? An hour and twenty minutes. All right. Did it get cloudy or is it getting stormy? Cloudy. Okay, foggy. Yep. Good gosh. Um. Hour and twenty minutes. We're using up our time though, isn't it? It's getting kind of dark, I think. Okay, so let's do this. Let's check inside this train car. We can always come back for that other wolf. Um, Alright, this is when I do want the lantern. <laughs> see what's in here. Oh, look. Okay, a couple of things. What's in here? Nothing. Bandage. And that's all. Okay. So, don't need this at the moment. How much time? Hard to tell how much time is left. Um, how much weight are we carrying? 90 pounds. Okay, so here's the question. Do we take the time to harvest this guy and head back? All right, that's an hour and 20 minutes with the knife, 50 minutes with the axe. All right, let's harvest the meat. It is getting darker. All right, and for the hide and the guts, hour and 25 minutes with the hatchet, 50 minutes with the knife. All right, let's do it, and then we'll head home. Two hours left. Feels like night is coming. Hour. All right, let's uh, let's go back to the rifle. Although we don't want to have to use the rifle, guys, that is that is pretty phenomenal. That is a whole lot of wolf that we have killed there. Yeah, we're not running anywhere. I think we've cleaned all three bodies, so keep walking. Uh, let's just get home, get inside, unload all these goodies, um, and then we'll go from there. That's uh, that's just amazing. I gotta say, guys, that's the best I've uh, done with a rifle um, in this game. Uh, I think since the first time I ever played it, which was in you know I played it in what the easiest mode, and in easiest mode, I mean I I don't I think even the shooting was easier. So <laughs> I don't know if it really counted, but that was pretty cool. I mean that's uh, what we killed. Uh, uh, one, two, was that just, just the three deer? But yeah, or, or three, three wolves, and we got to hide off of one deer. So that's good. Of course, we did waste two extra shots early on and wasted one shot on that, uh, wolf. So, you know, we, it would be nice if we could find some more ammunition. But at this point, um, I'm not sure where else we would go to find that ammunition. Uh, we've, so far, we've checked uh, most of the places that I can think of. Um, but I know that there's still some areas that are kind of north um, of the lake that we've not explored. So, hey, who knows? Maybe there's something up that way. Uh, we could always check. And uh, if there's anything I've, I have found in this game is that if there's a place where you can explore, you should explore it because you'll find the most, you know, surprising things uh, in the areas that you didn't expect to find anything. All right, let's come over this crest and let's hope there's not a wolf between us and the house. Uh, I imagine we could duck and shoot it if we had to, but what I would rather do is just get to the house. And it is getting dark. Why don't we switch over to this? Here 
hear the wolves barking out on the ice. You know, I've wondered is if they see the lamp, do they come running to the lamp? See, we can't run. We're too too heavily burdened. All right, let's just get inside. Whew. We made it. Let's drink some water. Looks like we're very thirsty. We're carrying a tremendous amount of wolf meat. So, uh, and uh, some deer meat, which you can see that's 900 calories per kilo, 2.2 pounds, versus wolf meat, which is 800 calories per kilo. So, I think what we'll do at this point, let's eat the remainder of that fish, get our calories up a bit. That gets us up to 1,200. The last of that cooked wolf get us up to 2,000 calories. All right, and uh, you know that's not bad. Two, yeah, we'll just uh, we'll we'll just be happy with that. Let's get over here and uh, let's throw down these new hides and uh, such that we have. All right, so we can probably throw I, I think throw all three of these down on top of each other because they should all be at the same gooiness <laughs> for lack of a better term there we go and we've got eight eight um, guts that are all at the same point so let's step forward uh, a little bit here and we'll drop all of those at the same place drop all okay so we've got uh, tons of guts here some of it in different stages of curing and now we also have a deer hide. So let's step over here a bit to the right. And uh, let's drop that deer hide that we picked up. Okay. So there we go. Lots of stuff to cure. Um, so what we need to do right now, pick up that piece of cedar and let's put this, this out here. How much wood are we carrying? Um, you know, not much just that one piece of wood so uh, I probably should have left the uh, the lamp on there we go um, let's slip oh look at that how did we miss that a can of soup down there wonder what else we missed anything anything Bueller Bueller wow okay well <laughs> All right, we'll just go with that. Uh, okay, maple saplings at 80%. All right, let's just... Uh, oops, wrong, wrong cabinet. Um, there we are. Let's pull us over... Let's say three pieces of this. Well, let's make it four. All right, and uh, now let's go over here and we'll turn this lamp back off. And stash it. There we go, and let's go ahead and squat down. Let's get a fire going, shall we? All right. Got sticks, we got matches, we're at 78% right now. Oh, what a day. A great day, guys. Definitely a great day. All right, well, I'll tell you what, while we're getting this fire going and I'm cooking this meat, I'll let you guys go. Thanks for joining me on the Long Dark. It was a very profitable day. We got wolf hides. We got deer hides. We got wolf meat galore. Hey, looks like we're going to do all right. Thanks again. Hey, I'm L2. This is the Long Dark. Let's just survive.